Here is some video footage from our family camping trip in the summer of 2021. And this was our second trip to Algonquin Provincial Park in Ontario. We chose to camp at Mew Lake for this trip. And there were some things we loved about Mew Lake and there were some things that were not our favorites. I would love to take you along and share our experience with you. When we arrived at the Mew Lake front office, we were a bit confused because there is quite a long drive into the park until you get to where the campsites are. This is the only office for Mew Lake, so you have to drive all the way out here if you'd like to purchase wood or need to ask any questions from the people in the office. When we choose campsites at any campground, we are looking for privacy, first of all, but we also love to be on the water. And we were lucky enough to get a site right on New Lake. You have to be careful when booking sites on this lake, though, because many of the campsites are very close to the highway that runs directly through the middle of Algonquin. When booking, I thought that the lake would be big enough that where we got our campsite, we wouldn't be able to hear the road. But that actually wasn't the case as Mew Lake is quite a small lake in Algonquin. So just be aware that you may hear some vehicle noise and traffic during the day, but once it got to nighttime, it, everything really settled down and we couldn't hear the road much at all. The views over the lake really made it all worth it, even though it was such a small lake. And this was a special trip because as a family, this was our first year taking a canoe. So it felt really comfortable for us to practice with our kids in the canoe on this smaller lake because we knew if anything happened, we could easily swim to shore from any point of the lake with the children in their life jackets. One of the best parts of New Lake was how many birds and ducks and geese there were on the lake. I didn't get a video, but there was one loon that was living on the lake and would talk all night and early in the morning. Listening to the loon sounds was just incredible. Our kids specifically loved the ducks. Right off of our campsite, there was an easy place to launch our canoe or even walk out to go swimming. So again, if you would like to be close to the water and you don't care about the traffic noise, this is an amazing place to camp. Our entire family could not get over the views from our campsite. It felt like you were in the middle of nowhere and on this particular day we got to watch this giant rainstorm blow in and then just look at all those clouds billowing over the lake and the mist forming. It was amazing. We loved this part of our campsite. And you'll see that the majority of the pictures and videos we took were just of this view over the lake from our site. Like I said, my kids were obsessed with the ducks at Mew Lake. Every day when we got back to the campsite, we were looking for ducks. But another bird that was all over were the blue jays. And it was so cool to just see these huge blue jays living their best life, eating wild blueberries, and hanging out all over the campsite. 
As a family, we don't spend a ton of time at our campsite except for in the evening. And we are usually hitting all of the hiking trails and biking and canoeing for most of the day. And this trail starts right at the washrooms in Mew Lake. And it's incredible. You hike out and there's this awesome little waterfall. You can get in right here and swim. It was a cool little hike to have so close by. I think I have to say the biggest benefit to Mew Lake for us was we were able to just put the canoe in any time of day. We didn't have to carry it to any launch point or to any beach. You could just hop in right before supper or right before the kids were going to bed and take a little paddle around the lake and it was no issue at all. There was tons of mature trees for us to hang up our hammocks. And the campsites were massive. You'll see in these next few clips as I pan around our entire campsite, we were able to fit our huge eight person tent, our kitchen shelter, two cars, hammocks, and have tons of room for the kids to even still ride bikes on our campsite without endangering any of our setup. We even had a little changing tent as well, and we were pulling our cars far into the campsite. This place was massive, and you could barely see the people who were camping across from you and camping beside you. To round off our view of Mew Lake, this isn't exactly the type of place we would camp usually, but we had a great time. We loved the water views and the huge campsite and the access to all of the hiking trails. Algonquin is always an amazing place to stop for a camping trip. We are counting down the days until we get to visit Algonquin again this summer. Hey.